In the face of such devastation, man tends to resort to one of three of Kierkegaard's characters. The immediate cultural individual reserves themselves to trivial matters, goes to work, drinks with friends, spends their leisure away unquestionably. The introvert feels confident in that they are in some way different from the world, that they are special and can't simply express their specialness to others as they will not understand, and so they hold themselves apart from the world. And so he lives in a kind of incognito, content to toy in his periodic solitudes with the idea of who he might really be, content to insist on a little difference to pride himself on a vaguely felt superiority. And then there is the self-created man, or wannabe god, or hedonist, who plunges into life in a demonic rage. They may seek forgetfulness in temporal pleasures where one lives for the day alone, with a defiance of tomorrow. Or they may engage in a sort of Prometheanism, a thoughtless immersion in the project of becoming god through engaging in war, arms races, capital accumulation, a rage against our impotence, a defiance of our animal condition, our pathetic creature limitations.